Hi friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Sigrid and I make videos about books because I love them. Today I'm going to be doing my Battle of the Subscription Box Fantasy Edition and this one is going to be a big one. Uh, if I count it correctly, I have about 17 things to go through. Get started with something that is new to my channel, which is a order from the Broken binding. Now, I do not have a subscription to this box, but I did order something that was on their site that I thought looked really pretty, and I'm excited to see how it looks. So first off, this is the prettiest packaging that I've ever seen. It's like a little gift. I don't even want to open it. It's so stunning. Ah, oh, look at that. What does it say? Oh, the dragon's horde. That's so cute. I, oh, I don't want to open it. It's so pretty. Okay, but I will. Oh, it's so stunning, and they're gold. Okay. All right, let's open... No, let's open this one first. I feel like it's Christmas time. Okay, so the first book I got is The Bone Season by Samantha Shannon. I actually really wanted the series. I thought it looked really beautiful, and I was really shocked that it was still in stock when I you know ordered it so i definitely jumped at the chance so pretty so this is the cover here in papers and other side let's see how it looks naked stunning Okay, and on the back it says, I am Paige Mahoney. I am the Pale Dreamer. Okay, so let's see what this one is. Okay, I think this one might be my favorite edges. These are so pretty. Wow. Just wow. Okay, and this is the cover. This is the back. And it says, this time I didn't just have to survive, I had to win. In papers. Okay, and the other side. And the back it says Scion, no safer place. These are the edges again. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, so next up is another box that is new to my channel. This is Satisfiction, and I have three boxes of theirs to unbox. Some of these are pre orders, some of these are subscription. This is a BIPOC sci fi fantasy subscription box. Each of the books will be from a diverse author. So two of these are pre orders, and one of these are actually the subscription. Let's go over the pre orders first, and then I'll get into the subscription because I am a subscriber. The first book that I am seeing is Dragon Fruit, and this is by Makai Lucia and it comes with a signed book plate. This is the cover. This is the back. These are the beautiful edges. And then there's no end papers. So there's no end papers and it's just a plain book. So it's really just the edges. They're very stunning. Okay, so the second pre-order is here. I was so excited for this book to come out. I didn't pre-order it because I knew I was getting it from Satisfiction, but this was the longest wait that I've ever waited because I, I just wanted it so fast. I wanted it immediately when it came out and I had to wait a few more weeks. So I'm so happy it's here. I cannot wait to dive into the story. I heard that it's like Harry Potter, but if it was at an HBCU, so... I'm, I'm all for it. So let's open this up. And on the back, you can see the, like, admittance letter to Cayman Admissions. So this is, it's a magic school book. I'm super excited. I'm excited. I'm so excited. Okay, so these are the edges. Stunning. These are the tops. So it's like regular sprayed, and then you get to the edge. And I think this one might be signed. It's not signed and I didn't get a um I didn't get an Arthur plate and mine isn't signed so I don't know if I'm missing it but this is the Arthur here. And I actually have seen a few of his lives pop up on um in, on TikTok so I'm excited to read this and I've heard great things. Okay, and we have the actual subscription box. You can see that it's it's here and I get the just the books subscription. 
um, and this is the May 2024 box and this is actually a bi-monthly box so the next box that we would get would be July's box this is the book um, it is the poison we drink by Bethany Baptiste uh, we also get another signed book plate here so let me unwrap okay so this is the beautiful cover here It's just a pink book. I do like that though. I think that this is like my favorite edge so far on their books because I like that it's like it just grows into yeah I love that and if you guys want to see a picture of the Arthur this is her yes so I'm excited. At the back it says, use it to protect you and those in your heart. It makes you brave to some and a monster to others but not all monsters are monstrous. I'm excited. I'm excited about that. Okay, so next up we have my Fable order. So I am currently my subscription is on pause, but um, I do subscribe to the Trinity. I did skip, uh, I think July's box. Uh, recently, they did reach out to us to let the, to let us know that they will be moving away from the U.S. and still shipping from I believe it's Australia. And so the shipping is going to go up. So now I am just really trying to determine if it's something that I want to continue to do. Uh, the books are extremely far behind. This is the February 2024 box and I recently got this. I believe I either got it this month or late last month. So they're extremely far behind so you will still see a few of the boxes going forward because they have to catch up but um, after July I'm not really sure the future of me unboxing these. So I actually purchased this book, which is a fable pick from someone from, I believe, Macquarie or Facebook for a really good deal. Um, but this is Twisted Game by Eva Ashwood. I got it because I love how it looks. It's so pretty. I love the edges. Like, oh my gosh, look at that. That is freaking stunning. And it gets better. So these are the end papers. This is actually a part of a series. So it's book one in the Filthy Wicked Psychos series. Back in papers. And then look at that. Look at this. Oh my goodness. This is pretty. I love that. So yes, I had to get it. So let's unbox my February 2024 Trinity box. With Trinity, you get all of the options, and I believe this was one of those special months where I actually get an extra book, and I pay for that. Um, so I think every every other month or every three months, you they throw in like an additional like dark book that you can get, and it's depending on your subscription, it's different prices. But for since I have a Trinity, I pay the least amount. I think I pay like twenty bucks for it which is good. So to keep up with each of the book, I did write on a post-it note which box these books would have come in. So this first one would have come in the Moonlight Paranormal box. Um, I think this is the additional like add-on. Yeah, so this is Ecstasy Unbound Guardians of the Realm by Seta J. In papers. And in papers. And I believe it is signed. Yes, it is signed. So next up we have Fabled Midnight. This is their dark romance box. Um, and this is Hitch by Laurel Beale. papers and papers there's nothing on the reverse dust jacket the next book would have come in their fable nights series so this is a mix of contemporary and spicy 
but it's like just regular books okay so nothing extra in it uh this is hostel saints book one by india r adams this is part of their steel stallions mc series so this is the cover oh i do like that foiling there that is stunning this is the edge it's just blue and then goes to black okay let's see oh so interesting no end papers here yeah so let's see the naked cover i do like the foiling on this evermore Oh, there's something in the... on. Okay, it says, She is why I will do whatever it takes. I don't know if you guys can make that out, but it's, like, written here. You have to, like, really... The lights would have to dim. And the final book would have been in their Fable Twilight box. This is their Romanticy box, so there might be some paranormal things in here. Um, so this is To Carve a Fay Heart by Tassanja Odette. And it's part of the Fair Isle Trilogy. So this is the cover, edge, Okay, and that's everything that I have for Fable at the moment. I will still unbox these for the next few months. So, uh, yeah. Okay, so we're going to head into my Illumicrate boxes. I have three Illumicrate and one from their horror subscription, which is Evernight. So I'm actually going to go into there first. So let's do Evernight first since it's only one of those, and then we'll go back to the Illumicrate boxes. So this is from their April 2024 box. This is a quarterly book box, so it doesn't happen every month. Um, and I actually am now subscribed to it, so I will be getting their July box. So stay tuned for that. Okay, so the book for this month is Murder Road by Simone St. James. I just was in love with this cover. I don't know why, I just love their edition, so I had to get it but it's so pretty and this is the back this is the side you obviously can see why I think it's pretty it's pink of course love and let's see oh my gosh I love the end papers it's it's like comic book graphic novel girl those are photos never mind it's just photos what am I thinking oh my god look at this holy smokes i didn't even see this i was looking at this part i love this oh i love this so much this is so pretty this is prettier outside of the dust jacket oh my goodness look it's a map that is so cute i love it look i love this this is so pretty Okay, and there's, there's nothing here. Uh, is it signed? Let's see if it's signed. Oh, did we get another end papers? Okay, yeah. I didn't show you guys the other end papers. It's more pictures. And do, 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 do. it is signed by Simone St. James. Love. This is so cool. I'm excited to read this one. This seems like a book that I, I would like. That's it for Evernight. Let's move on to Illumicrate. The first book that I got is actually an order from the shop. So let's get started with that. So this is the Strange the Dreamer um, series. So the first book is Strange the Dreamer. I think they look pretty and I was really shocked that they were still in the store. So I got it before it sold out and people started selling them for like ridiculous amounts of prices. So um, the cover, I think it's really unique and interesting. And... In paper, oops, in papers. And 
it is signed by Lainey Taylor. And this is the Naked book. And there's nothing on the dust jacket. Okay, and then we have Muse of Nightmares. This is book two. Oh, that's pretty. And then Okay, so now we're on to my subscription. I have two boxes. The first one is April 2024. Okay, and the theme for this box is magic versus science. All right, so I'm just gonna pull out some things here. The first thing, I've seen so many people unbox this and I love doing puzzles and listening to audiobooks. And I just think the box is so stunning. Look at that. It says science fiction bookcase is a thousand piece jigsaw puzzle. Stunning. Okay, and this is the inside. I cannot wait to play around with this, so this is gonna be really fun. Okay, so this next item is a Choose Me bookmark tin. This is inspired by Song of Silver Flame Like Night. This is how it looks. And it says, I wish for you to not go anywhere without me in this world and the next. I wish for you to choose me. And this is the inside. The next thing is a um, botanical constellation gardening gloves. Um, so these are just gardening gloves. I don't really garden, so this, I'm not really sure what to do with this. Okay, and the next thing we have is Moths and Poppies reusable wash pads. This is inspired by the Bone series by Samantha Shannon. So let's see. Oh, cute, cute colors. So I'm just gonna. Okay, I think it's just two designs. Okay, and the featured book is To Gaze Upon Wicked Gods by Molly X. Chain. It says, enjoy your Illumicrate exclusive edition, which is signed royal hardback and features an exclusive coat cover colorway in paper a full color a full color design on the case a digitally printed four edge and is signed by the author so let's see okay so this is the cover edge edge up here And then let's see. Ooh, these are pretty. In papers. In papers. Okay, so we're going to move on to the last box. This box actually just came yesterday. This is the May 2024 box. And the theme for this one is Magical Bonds. The first thing I am seeing is a mug. Okay. Okay. Oh, and that mug was inspired by Fourth Wing. 
The next thing is the Elven Tribe Food Clips. This is inspired by Feybound. And these are just like little clips for like bags of potato chips and things like that. Next up we have a storybook setting magnet book keep. This is inspired by the Realms of the Elderling. Okay. Next up we have this book organizer here. It's inspired by the Hurricane Wars. The feature book is Goddess of the River by Vashnadi Patel. Uh, it says, enjoy your Illumicrate exclusive edition, with it, which is a royal hardback with an exclusive cover, foil embossing on the hardback, digitally printed four edges, block spray top and bottom edge, illustrated in papers, a bound in Arthur letter, and it's digitally signed. Let's see. I've actually seen so many unboxings of this one, and mine just came, so I actually love this i love it so much this is so pretty i love the flowers i think it's gorgeous and then of course it's pink up top and on the bottom really pretty these are the in papers and i believe it might be the same on both sides and then we have some foil on the cover and there's nothing on the back but isn't that just stunning naked wow i should just have some books just naked and there's nothing on the reverse okay friends we are down to our very last set of boxes fairy loot and i saved the best for last because we have seven boxes to unbox for fairy loot we have two pre-orders three adult and two ya boxes to unbox let's get started so i'm gonna start with the pre-orders here the first book is the ruthless vows by rebecca ross and this is the second book in the series yeah and it just recently came and they have foil on the end papers here really pretty foil here it's really pretty and then this is the naked covers and edges again and there's nothing on the reverse dust jacket Okay, next up is this is another sequel in a series. This is Emily Wiles Map of the Other Lands by Heather Fawcett. I actually got book one in a subscription box a while back, so I'm just collecting the rest of the series. Okay. In papers. Other side. This is the naked and edges. And once again, nothing on the reverse. Okay, moving right in to the three adult boxes that I got. This is the June 2024 box, and we're going to work our way to the previous box. Okay, always comes in a little baggie here. And the theme for this month is Demons and Deities. And the book is... The Guide in the Gumby Ho by Sophie Kim. I actually met her at the Imaginarium Book Festival. She is really lovely. I actually ended up getting a paperback copy of this book. So that is really cool. The edges are out of this world. Stunning. This is the back. Here we have... I don't know if you guys can kind of tell, but there's like a little bit of like things on here that has foiling in it. It pops up like, yeah, like you can see it now, like these little things, they're foiled. Isn't that cool? That's really cool. I love that. Okay. And then this side. Oh my gosh. I love this cover that is so pretty so pretty edges again and I forgot to show the top and bottom so pretty and we actually have art on the reverse pretty 
Next up, we have the May box. And the theme for this one was Cottage Core. And the book is The Honey Witch by Sydney J. Shields. This is how it looks. Edges. Oh, and I think you guys should really pay attention to this because they're like little honeycombs. So cool. I do love that. And then in papers here, I see some foilings. Okay. We have it here. More foiling too. And then look at that. Oh, wow. That is pretty. Okay, we do have a reversible dust jacket. Now let's put it down. Okay, let me see. Oops. This is it. And the last adult box we have is April 2024. The theme for this one is the occult. Okay, and the book for this month is Evocation by S.T. Gibson. And we have, oh, this is a reversible dust jacket. We also have a letter from the author here and on the back we have this art print. Okay, so now we can get into the YA boxes. These will be the last two boxes in the video. This is the May 2024 box and the theme is Scholarly Secrets. The first thing I am seeing is these Dark Academia book tabs. Let's see how they look. I love tabs. So. Next up, we have a glasses case, and this is inspired by The Temptation of Magic. Next up, we have a cushion cover. I think this is the picture here. And then here. And this is inspired by The Atlas Six by Olive B. Blake. Then next up, we have the Collection of Magical Tombs, Volume 4. And this is in this box. Okay. Oh, wait. <laughs> Here it is. And it says, Lessons on the Classical Arts. And then we have a study in drowning pin. Oh, it's a little typewriter. This is so pretty. Okay, and we have two tarot cards. We have four of sun and three of sun. And finally, we have the book. This is The Temptation of Magic by Megan Scott. And this is the front and the back. And we have a reversible dust jacket. And on to the final box in this video. This is June 2024. And the theme for this one is Decadent Desires. The first thing I'm seeing is a scrunchie. This is inspired by Poison Study by Maria V. Snyder. 
Next up, we have a water bottle, and this is inspired by The Darkness Within Us by Trisha Levenseller. Oh, it's glass. It says, it is the little things in life that provide the most enjoyment. Cool. Next up, we have an embroidery kit inspired by the Crimson Moth. Um, I don't know if I can take this out. It's a kit. Let's see. Yeah, so it's like a little crafting kit here. And here are like the fabrics and things right here. I didn't want to take it all out. I guess I can. You know, I think this might be something my mom would love to like play around with. So I might send it to her to see if she wants to take up embroidery. Okay, so next up we have page ends. And these are inspired by A Court of Thorns and Roses by Sarah J. Maas. These are probably like were probably crazy about these it's like a mix between purple and blue almost that's cool i don't know if you guys can make out like the design but we have some foil bookmarks inspired by the shadow me series by tahira mafi i love getting foil bookmarks so i'll just so this is the first one i don't know if you guys can kind of make out the foil but this one has green and this one has this one has silver so it's kind of hard to see this one is purple very vivid yeah you can see this one for sure and then this one is this one's like a brown maybe gold color and then the last one oh this is a pretty blue Ew, that's so pretty. We have two tarot cards. We have Five of Suns and Six of Suns. We have the Book of the Month, which is The Darkness Within Us by Trisha Levenseller. This is the cover. This is the top. It's sprayed black. And the bottom is black. Let's see. In papers. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, look at that. It's so pretty. That's pretty. And is it signed? I haven't been looking at the signatures. Okay, we have a signed Arthur's note in it, which it's like the signature here. And we have artwork. Pretty. Okay, you guys, that is everything that I have for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, I will see you guys later. Bye.